Good afternoon, Edward. What's wrong? You're right, Edward. It is. Hmm. There's a shame. Dear, oh dear, oh dear. Well, uh, I'll see you later, Edward. You have a train to pull. You too, Edward. I think I have to call an old friend. I like to think that is the case, Thomas, but I'm afraid to say it is not. Apparently, all the children and engines on the island of Sodor are said by Santa himself, Naughty. Well then, I guess you're off to the North Pole then. Hello, Mr. Conductor. It is nice to see you again. If it's for the children, then yes. In the meantime, Percy, you will take care of Thomas's branch line, and Dennis will do your jobs. Rebecca and Murdoch can take care of the express and some heavy workloads. Good thinking, Edward. All right, that's enough. You all have a busy day coming up, so I'll see you all tomorrow morning. Good night, engines. You too, Mr. Conductor. Not yet, Percy. But don't worry, it will be fine. All you have to do is believe. Mr. Conductor, you made it back. The children are just about to go to bed. We also have some gifts that came from the mainland so the children would have something to open. So that is a lot to do. Indeed I do. Mr. C, can you help us at the shed? Wonderful. All right, everyone. Let's get to work. Don't worry about us, Thomas. You all earned it. I am very proud of all of you. You all are really useful engines. The same with you, Mr. C. Merry Christmas, Mr. C. Well, he couldn't if my plan didn't work. I called Santa and told him everything that you told me, and we came up with this idea. It most definitely did. Well, I'm going home. Good night, everyone, and Merry Christmas, everyone.